Hey guys, today I have a $40 grocery haul for you. That means that everything in this haul adds up to be less than $40. So what do we have included? We have breakfast for every day of the working week, lunch for every working day, and also four dinners. So this is an awesome grocery list to bring with you to the grocery store on Sunday to get ready for the work week. So let's get started. Now you're gonna have the same thing for breakfast every day. I know this might sound boring, but when you're on a budget and also you're trying to maintain a weight loss or lose weight, eating the same thing actually has been shown to work when it comes to weight loss. I have some organic raw and simple bare oatmeal from Better Oats. I got this on sale for less than $2 and it comes with 10 pouches. So that's actually two working weeks worth of breakfast. That made sense, right? Then that might not be enough for you guys. So we also have bananas. Each one of these puppies was just 29 cents at Trader Joe's. And also if you want some protein, I highly recommend bringing some hard boiled eggs. Go ahead and grab 12, hard boil them when you get home and then they're perfect for snacks or to bring for breakfast for a filling meal. So the total for your breakfast is just $6 for the week. That's the bananas, the eggs, and the oatmeal. Then we have lunch. Recently, I went to Aldi's. It is a discount grocery store. If you're not familiar with what Aldi's is, I have a link down below in the more info. I bought this canned tuna, which is wild caught, and it's also solid white albacore in water, no salt added. Uh, there's two servings in here. So for lunch, what I like to do is I like to make some tuna salad with hummus and also Dijon mustard. You guys know this. And then I will wrap it up. I really like these Joseph's flax wheat bran whole wheat flour uh, tortillas. There's just 70 calories in them. And for five of them, or for six, I'm sorry, just $3. So you wrap that up with a little bit of lettuce. This here is Olivia's. I got this at Whole Foods. It's a little bit more expensive. But last week I did buy the identical package with organic lettuce from Aldi's for just $2. It's insane how cheap Aldi's is. You need to check it out. Now it's probably not gonna fill you up for lunch because it wouldn't fill me up for lunch. So I also have included some baby carrots and hummus. I bought these baby carrots at Trader Joe's for less than $2. I got this at Trader Joe's for $2.99, but I got the exact same thing, same packaging and everything at Aldi's for just $1.99. So if you don't have an Aldi's, you can go to Trader Joe's, it is a dollar more, but if you're budget conscious and you do have an Aldi's nearby, check it out. So then you have your full, you had a nice hearty breakfast and lunch. You want an afternoon snack, a pick me up before you work out maybe. So I've included some rice cakes and also peanut butter. Now I don't eat rice cakes a ton. I would love to eat um, peanut butter with celery, but let's be honest, you know, celery's kind of a pain in the butt sometimes to chop up and bring with you. So if you're going to work, make yourself a nice little PB and J or just PB and um, rice cake sandwich. Maybe add in some banana if you'd like. Um, I got these again at Aldi. I just did a grocery shopping there, which is why a lot of these products are included from them. Same thing as Trader Joe's. So you can get a thing of natural peanut butter at Trader Joe's for less than $2. This is the organic, so it is a dollar more, less than $2 to get a jar of peanut butter without any sugar added. And then these rice cakes here were less than $2 as well. There's 14 rice cakes in here, so if you have two at a time, it's gonna last you all week. For dinner, yes, you are going to be eating the same thing again. I know you're getting tired of it, but trust me, when it comes to weight loss, eating the same thing and having meals planned out works. And also, it saves you money and time from planning what you're gonna have. So I went and picked up this bag of sweet potatoes and you're not gonna believe how much they are when I tell you. I got all of these sweet potatoes for less than $3. Uh, a lot of times Trader Joe's does have a bunch of sweet potatoes, especially when they're in season, they are less money. So you can definitely pick up enough sweet potatoes for the week under $4, but these were like $2.39 crazy cheap. You can either have them as uh, baked sweet potatoes where you just put them in the oven and roast them, uh, stab it with some forks, or you could chop them up, add in some allspice and some salt and roast them to make kind of like sweet potato home fries. You have your roasted or baked sweet potato and then we are going to have some shrimp. Right here, I have a bag of frozen shrimp, uh, jumbo easy peel raw shrimp. There are four servings inside of this bag, so you'll want to thaw them and then you can cook them. They take no time at all, which is why I love shrimp. They're really quick. 
uh, when it comes to preparing. So if you don't have a lot of time to make dinner, they're a great option. And they're also healthy. Uh, serving is only 100 calories and you also get 19 grams of protein. So this was $7. Um, you can get similar, similar frozen fish at Target or also Trader Joe's um, with similar pricing. This was an Aldi buy. So how to save money on vegetables, buy them frozen. This huge bag I got at all these was less than $4. And this has seven servings. Now, I'm not gonna have one serving. Um, I would have like two or three each time I were to make this. So you can either serve this with brown rice if you don't wanna do the sweet potato and then add the shrimp on top. Add in a little soy or tamari sauce and there you have a delicious dinner. So all of these foods add up to less than $40. You're gonna get four dinners, five lunches, and also you're gonna get five breakfasts. Now I bought two of the cans of tuna. Um, the fifth day you might not have tuna, so I recommend making egg salad instead. So you'll have some hard boiled eggs left over, take those, chop them up, add in some hummus, and then mix that in with your lettuce as the wrap. Yum, delicious. You can play with your own egg salad recipe if you like. I have a lot of other haul videos and stick around. At the end of this video, you're gonna see links to watch the other haul videos, including ones where I share what I eat in a day, what my favorite breakfast foods are. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel. I upload new videos every week for you guys. Let me know what you thought. Recommend a new video down below and I'll see you soon. But they sell the exact same thing at Aldi's. Wah, wah, wah.